Coral found her dress at the boutique a year ago after challenging Joe and Al to come up with an outfit suitable for a farm wedding. I absolutely adore this dress, but I want to check one thing. I know what it is. <laughs> Let's go. <laughs> well, it's a first, but it works. I tend to go for baggy clothes, normally my wellies, my mucking out boots, leggings or pyjamas. But Joe and Al really got me out of that and found a dress that's absolutely amazing. I know how much Coral and Henry would really like children and they haven't had it easy the last few months. So me and Joe just have to wrap extra loving care around Coral for this appointment. We need to focus on the positives. Hi. Oh, oh hello. hello. Long time no see. So you're here for your fitting? Yes. Everything under control? She's stressing about the wedding more than I am, and right. then she's trying to stress me out. Right. Not deliberately, I might okay. add. OK. I'm 99% of the way there. Mum doesn't believe that, but we are. I think it's Mum's job to make sure that everything is as it should be. This is her big day, and if there's anything I can do to make sure that everything goes smoothly, then I would like to do it. You, but you have got to be one of the most laid-back brides I've ever come across. As long as I marry Henry, I'm happy. Everything else can go wrong. Oh, that's really sweet. So you're ready to put this dress on, then? I can't wait. Oh, <laughs> come with me. I'm going to come catch up with you, Mum. That's it. I forgot how beautiful this is. I'm really excited to get back into it, see if I still love it the same way I did, and hopefully take it home with me today. Well, I think it's a little bit long at the moment, but I want your opinion on that. OK. Because, of course, I'll be wearing the wellies, and I don't want to put the wellie through the front of the dress. No. Or when I'm walking through mud or trying to get on the boat. Oh, God, you're going on a boat? Yeah, for pictures. The photos we have planned, we have some at the reception, as you'd expect, but we also want to have some in the boat on the lake down there. So I've got to get into a boat in wellies and a wedding dress, hopefully with someone holding the boat so it doesn't rock. If it went wrong, it went, that could go really, wrong. really wrong. All I would say is take yourself a set of dry clothes just in case. Yes. No. <laughs> I'm oh, not taking this off. How funny. <laughs> if that dress goes underwater, it's going to be heavy. Do we have divers? Deep in the Cornish countryside, it's Coral and Henry's big day. No, I don't feel organised at all for the wedding. It's just whatever happens, happens now. This isn't one of the most traditional wedding venues. It's a little bit quirky, a little, a little bit, bit different. Unconventional, yeah. shall we say. A little bit coral, even. But I like it. The whole wedding's a bit unique, so why not mix it up a bit more? Teepees, lakes, boats, what more do you need? Oh, the boat. It's not a cruise liner. Yeah, it's not a cruise liner. It's not even a ferry or a jet ski. No. I mean, this is a tin bath with oars. I am quite concerned about falling in. <laughs> We've just got to go with it. We've just got to make sure Coral has an amazing day, do everything we can to get her in this dress and make her feel so special. Oh, look at this little mother's meeting. <laughs> mother's meeting. I'd have called it a little oh, cavern yeah. myself. <laughs> the professional. Yeah, more of a cavern. Love you. See you after. OK. Coral is probably the most laid back bride I have ever come across. Mm. I feel today we might have to periodically check her for a pulse because she's just so laid back. I have to say, this whole boat scenario thing has really been making me panic quite a lot. Have you practised this boat? If I practised, how many times would I have fallen out? If I do it just once, it's a 50 50 chance I fall in. And what happens if you do fall in? Then You'll I'll get laugh wet. and get wet. Yeah. Oh, well. And in this heat, I'll dry out within a half hour. It is a little bit, oh, is she going to fall in? Am I going to laugh? Oh, please, please don't let me laugh. I mean, I wonder if she actually rode a boat before. Time to get in the dress. That's perfect. How does it feel putting this back on again? Lovely. I did have to have an extra little panel put in as well, though. Did you have oh, a little bit of weight, Gay? No, I've got a baby. What? <laughs> oh, my God. Oh, so. Coral, congratulations, darling. There's going to be a little coral or a little Henry on the horizon very soon. Yeah, that, that's a nice bit of news. Do you know what? Corals, she's not had it easy. They've been trying for a baby for quite a long time. It's just the best. Yeah. Congratulations. Yeah, it finally happened. On behalf of Henry and Coral, I would like to welcome you all here on this, their special day. I ask you now, Henry, 
Will you take Coral to be your wife? Will you rejoice with her through the good times and will you remain true to her for the rest of your lives together? I will. I accept all that you are. And all that you will be. I promise that I will comfort and cherish you. With love and affection, friendship and respect. In joy and in sorrow. And Henry, I invite you to kiss your bride. For us now, normally, our job is done. Oh no, not today. We have the boat. We have to get Coral and Henry and the wellies and the dress in a boat. Yeah, but I can't do this. I'm wearing a child's life jacket. We're your welcoming committee. <laughs> You are my lifeguards, are you? Hey, there we go. Congratulations, Mr. Lucy. Yes. And Mrs. Now, let's get down there and do the lifeguarding. <gasps> Can't look. Keep calm, Coral. Don't panic. Oh, my <laughs> oh, oh. Coral, I'm scared. <laughs> <laughs> okay. I mean, at times I have to say my heart was in my mouth. But you know, I am a lifeguard, so after all, I have to remain calm. Hey, okay, you're on your own now, okay? Are you sure you don't want the rubber ring in there? I only drive it. You can do it. Yeah. You wanted to do it. Enjoy it. I mean, I know it said go slow. Yeah, but that's, <laughs> but, but that's a bit slow. <laughs> that's it. That's it. I didn't. I stuck. <laughs> I mean, it wasn't the voyage of dreams. No, it wasn't like the Titanic. The man's holding the flowers and the, the bride and the, and is the rowing. the bride is rowing the boat. <laughs> Here we go. <laughs> yeah, I just want to get back in now. <laughs> Here we go. Look, they've done it. They've done it. Have you got some license in the boat? There we go. Coral wanted to get in the boat. She done the boat and that's it. And Coral wanted to get out the boat, so Coral got out the boat. Hold fire, yes. Coral. We're we are coming. coming, Coral. <sighs> right, come on, we're here. That's it, use his head. Come on, Gail. One, two, three, go! Oh. Okay, I'm out.